welcome to the Swartz Creek Area Art Gallery. It's a beautiful sunny day outside. Let's see what they've got inside. Oh, look. This time of year the waterfall is off, but it's a beautiful sight in the spring and summer. All right. Let's come on in. Oh, look at that. Oh, where to start? Where to start? We'll start this way. So much beautiful things to look at. Oh, what have we here? Each artist is different, and we have artists of all sorts of talents and variety. So many different and beautiful things to see. The walls have artwork on them that change on a regular basis. So it's never going to be the same gallery twice. Some comfy chairs for sitting in. Some beautiful things on the wall. I have to even back up because I missed a basket. Full of some beautiful scarves and handiwork. And at the moment, we have an empty spot. Oh no! But if you're an artist, that spot could be yours. Everything is done by local artists. Oh, back there, that sign says that the pine needle baskets are made from needles of the loblolly on Australian pine trees with black walnuts. We do try to celebrate the seasons here at the art gallery. Lots of original work and prints as well. I think I see a Peggy Abrams in here. Yep, sure do. Many others. Oh, the pots. There's two beautiful pots on the windowsill and some more on the floor. That's a fundraising activity. Our artist decorated pots with some original artwork. Some walking sticks there in the corner. Yes, sir. Art on the wall of quite a variety. Oops. And more prints by our artists. Some of the originals and some just prints. We have photographers. Oil painters, mosaic artists, acrylics, like I said, something for everyone. Woodworkers, we have quite a variety of woodworkers, and at this time, none of the woodworkers we have use any kind of stains or dyes to um, make their wood look different. It's completely natural. And I'm going to go back to the top of our cabinet where you can see one of our worker workers has incorporated seashells into his woodworking for some beautiful ornaments. And there is a snowman on top. And over here, this one, there we go. The painting is on the reverse side of this window, hence the glare. And I am an amateur photographer, so please <laughs> bear with me as we take this virtual tour. Oh, but before we go down this wall, I want to go back to this wall over here that we missed. Different sizes, different shapes, different price ranges. A little something for everybody. And again, we change out the art. We ask the artist to change out their work every four to six weeks. So it's always a new gallery. A lovely piece. Huh? A 
lovely bench to sit on again to sit and think about your art look through some prints oh there we go sorry about the crookedness <laughs> only when it comes to hanging not when it comes to dealing with our artist I guarantee some more woodwork beautiful original one-of-a-kind pieces from some beautiful and original one-of-a-kind artists. Ooh. And here we're gonna go down and look at one of our cabinets. Well, first on top of the cabinet, I suppose. Some lovely woodwork, just, you almost, no, not almost, you definitely have to come in and see it for yourself. Our calendar, our 2012 calendar full of original artwork by, a, by a members of the Swartz Creek Art Guild. And I know you saw this one when we walked in, this big, beautiful print. Print, <laughs> I'm sorry. Big, beautiful original. No prints available of this particular piece. But gorgeous. Even more so in person, I guarantee that too. This is just a quick tour. We invite you to come out. Mondays, we are closed. But Tuesdays through Friday, we are open from noon to 5 p.m. And on Saturday, we're open from noon to 4. So you can take your time and enjoy the art. And there is almost always an artist on duty to talk to you about either their work or someone else's. We are very in big into promoting each other. We would love to see you, answer whatever questions we have, and if you're an artist, feel free to bring in a sample of what you do. Our jewelry counter, lots of beautiful original works here. Oh, and the candy dish, which I have to show you. There's also a piece of functional artwork, also known as craft. <clears throat> that one's made of recycled materials. But some beautiful, beautiful pieces. Some pottery on the bottom. We haven't yet opened our pottery studio, but we are continuing to work on it. Over here's some more little pieces. Now, I'm going to try to turn around slowly. We're going to be heading down this hallway, but before we do, I wanted to show you what we have over here on these shelves. We have got so much neat stuff for more than just two-dimensional art. We have some amazing three-dimensional art as well. Yes, those are fish. Very awesome carved fish. Note cards, puzzles, original works. Oh, so much fun. Oh, what do we have back here hiding? We have a couple of fairies, some fantasy work. That's a different thing. Bottles, vases, found art. Signs, even more, more puzzles and vases. Jewelry, scarves, beautiful scarves, and bookmarks and keychains. And this fabulous, and I'm going to actually interact with this piece just so you can see the inside of the mirror as well. Oh, and what camera I'm using, it's my Canon. Again, amateur photographer. 
I apologize for any seasickness this video may cause. Bottom shelves. Okay, now back to this hallway down here. On this wall, we have student artwork, for we're also a teaching studio. Lots of gorgeous student artwork from all ages and abilities. Please feel free to call and inquire about classes. The phone number here is 630-6076. And we'll get to that hallway too. But behind me, more work. Some very detailed, some very simple. down to what I like to refer to as the annex, although we do have a bathroom down here as well. We are working on a different hanging system so that we can incorporate more art nicely. Back here, most of this is also member art. Some of it is donated art. We sell that to help keep the lights on and the electric bill paid here at the gallery because we are a, fi oh, a 501c non-for-profit organization and we do the best we can to provide a place for artists to display their work for the public to come see to provide artwork for the public to come by this here's another donated piece. That one is not. A little bit of everything back in this hallway. Now, we also have back in this hallway another door to go through. This is our teaching and studio room. As you can see, it's pretty big. We have a window I'll try not to get a direct shot of. An easel, sink and running water, chairs, all sorts of supplies, fun, fun stuff, different artwork. Artwork from classes. This particular piece, this is the first time this person ever put paint to a canvas. Had a great teacher for that one. And back there, we're not going to go in that back room, but that is the clay and pot pottery studio that we are currently working on. This that you're looking at now is a hook rug from a member of the VSA, and that is also for sale. VSA stands for Very Special Art. It's a fabulous program. Another wall of student artwork of all abilities and styles once again. If you're interested in any kind of class, please give us a call. 630-6076 and we will um, see what we have for you in the way of teachers and classes. And we're going to turn the corner here. More backing up because I have even more student artwork. All sorts of fun and amazing stuff. All of this is copyrighted. Please, none of this is for you <laughs> to take and use as your own image, but we'd be happy to teach you how to do some of this, most of this stuff. Again, the classroom, bright and festive. <laughs> we do have a coffee pot. If you're willing to clean it, you can use it. Books on art to inspire. All sorts of good stuff. That's just the furnace room. We won't go in there either. I'll come back out. And that ends the tour of the Swartz Creek Area Art Gallery. Located at 8048 Miller Road, Swartz Creek, Michigan. Our zip code is 48473. And once again, our phone number is 630-6076. Six,